In From the Stars in the Sky to the Fish in the Sea, Mulan changes a lot depending on how they're feeling, but every aspect of their appearance, from fur and feathers to stripes and sparkles, are part of who they are and what makes them special. At the ROM, there are lots of examples of living things that go through a big change in what they look like. The word that scientists use for a really big change is metamorphosis. Like when our monarch caterpillars became butterflies, or our tadpoles turn into mossy frogs. Even upstairs, we see evidence of a big change in someone's appearance. When Queen Hatshepsut became Pharaoh, some of her statues show her wearing a queen's dress and crown, but other statues show her wearing the headdress, kilt, and beard that were worn by the male pharaohs before her. We even have an example of a sphinx with the body of a lion and the face of Hatshepsut. For our creativity challenge this week, we're going to go through our own metamorphosis and take inspiration from nature to find the shape that really represents us, just like Mulan in our story. Research plants and animals from nature, like in the ROM's online collections, and find things that resonate with you. Print out or sketch these examples of fur, feathers, quills, shells, stripes, or spots. Find or copy a picture of yourself and cut out your face from the photo. Place your face on a good background. Glue or draw your nature examples around your face, or combine the two, until you have a collage that shows off your metamorphosis. Add other materials like leaves, feathers, flowers, and other examples from nature to really make your transformation shine. Don't forget the sparkle! Take a photo of your transformation and share it with us at ROM Toronto, hashtag ROM at home.